Okay, fifth grade. As you know, Ms. Hine had to step out of the building um, this afternoon. So you are going to be with Ms. Clark. Um, what you're going to start off with is this meaningful math task. So Ms. Clark is going to hand them out. And my expectation is by the time I get to zero, you have glued them on and you are ready. So Ms. Clark's going to hand them out. So you should have a sheet of paper. This is the only one that should be on the sheet of paper is this task card. Remember, if you've not already turned in your homework, your homework should be turned in. So my expectation is by 10, it's glued in. There should not be any talking. You need to sit down. Nine, eight, seven, there should still be no talking, six, stop arguing over the glue, five, four, three, two, one. If at any time, Ms. Clark, you feel like I'm moving too fast, you may pause me for them to catch up. This is how we will normally work our meaningful math task. Ms. Hines is going to read it to you. You're going to have some time independently. Independently means you are not talking to one of your teammates right now to work on the problem. And then um, she's going to unpause me after you're going to work with your teammates. And then she's going to ask you how you solved it. And then she's going to unpause me. And you're going to make sure that you solve the problem correctly. So I'm going to start off with reading this. Mr. Nolet is constructing a lava lamp for his class. He can only afford to make one lava lamp. But the instruction sheets is for four lava lamps. How much on each material was, will Mr. Nolet need to have for one lava lamp? So here is the material for four lava lamps, but he only needs to make one of them. So you now need to try to figure out how you're going to solve this problem. So take a few minutes by yourself. Ms. Clark is going to pause me.